Veronica Chumikova, Anastasia Nachita, ready to rumble here at 59 kilos, Russia, Moldova. Nachita with the red Russian singlet, Moldova will go with the sky blue color. Double unders. Let's see if Nachita can work off this position and steer the Russian. Nope. Unable to develop any type of offense. Good job by Chumikova to get out of harm's way. Approaching the one minute mark in this first period. Still no score. The Russian women trying to take a page out of the Russian men's playbook. Boy, were they on a roll last night. The Russian men's freestyle team winning three European gold medals. They'll have a chance to add a few more tonight when the men's freestyle competition wraps up here in Poland. The passivity warning to Nachita of Moldova. Next time she will go on the clock. Minute 44 to go, first period, no score. Probably you're not going to let this position go too long. The referee will reset it. Coming right at her is the 21-year-old from Moldova. She's in on a single. Coming over the top. Curving the body over the top. Defensive play there by Chumikova. And the two wrestlers back on their feet. Oh, straight on power blast shot there by Chumikova. And it's countered by Nachita. Nicely done by Moldova that time as Chumikova came right in. Looked like she was close to finishing, but Nachita so agile. Able to avoid the two and then get two of her own. So two nothing lead for Nachita. Two minutes into this opening period, Moldova versus Russia, semifinal of 59. The other semifinal match is Belarus and Bulgaria. Dudova for Bulgaria, Pisarukina from Belarus. Both wrestlers ear to ear, 33 seconds to go. First period, Nachita still with the 2-0 lead, and that was the counter shot after a deep initial launch by Chumakova from Russia. Heavy on that head, the upper back area. Here comes Nachita again. And we'll get one more start in the center, just nine seconds to go. Lots of times you'll see these elite athletes, they use every second of a period. They'll get those unanswered points at the end of a period. Not in this case, but we'll see that, I guarantee you, by the end of the night. You talk about an athlete on a roll, that's how you can describe Russia right now with Veronika Chumakova. She's won five of her last eight events, including the 2020 Poland Open, the 2020 Russian National Championship. She won the Regan title, the Grand Prix of Spain, and also the President's Cup. In the opposite quarter with Nachita, she was a World Cup gold medal winner last year. She is looking for her third straight medal at this event. She was the gold medal winner of the European Championships a year ago and a bronze medalist in 2019. So she has had the bullseye on her back here today and tonight and the defending champion one of five defending champs in action on day one here in Warsaw with a two nothing lead a little bit more purpose from Chumakova in the early stages of this second period she's coming right at Nachita the 
And as a result, they will warn Nachita for the second time, and she's on the clock. So good job by the Russian, Shumikova. She's in on the double. Let's see if she can finish. This time she does. And Russia ties it up. Looking for a quick gut wrench, but lost her grip. Nachita comes around the side. She'll get the, the uh, reversal point and go up 3-2. So Chumakova twice has been in on that double. The second time she was able to get the two. And it looked like she was almost in a position to elevate for the wrench, but it, it, it broke, the grip broke at the last second. And Nachita was able to get the reversal point. Three to two, Moldova clinging to the lead. And potentially dangerous with the left leg of Nachita, so the official will stop it right away. So this is a good one inside two minutes to go and the defending champion being pushed by the Russian. 3-2, Anastasia Nachita clinging to the one-point lead. Looking for the arm throw was... Chumakova, she did not quite execute it, still has the arm trap. Nachita's gonna try to come around the top and then she blows right in. And both wrestlers back into a neutral position. Oh, Chumakova was about an inch away from grabbing the lead. Nice arm toss possibility there, just slipped at the last second. 3-2, Nachita continuing the lead by a point. The Russian taking more and more shots. I'd go back to that double if she could. See her trying to change levels. That's what she does. Comes right at the champion. And it backfired. It looked like they gave her, did they give her four? I don't think it was confirmed. Uh, it was a late confirmation coming. So four on the exposure for Chumakova and then two for Nachita. And I guarantee you they're going to take another look at this. The challenge brick coming in from Moldova. Off the initial look, it looked like Chumakova had the four. Nachita's shoulders exposed. And that's what they're going to be taking a look at. And it's what I was talking about. If, if you're Chumakova, that double leg has been golden for you. And it was the double, the blast double coming right here that appeared to take Nachita to her back. Boom, right there. Oh, maybe not, maybe not. It was really close, but as you take a second glance at it, I'm not sure it had the angle. Here comes the verdict. The challenge coming from Moldova in the blue corner. The challenge is won, I believe, by Moldova. He flipped it up so quick, I, I couldn't quite tell. As I took a second look at it, I don't think the four was going to stick. I think it was going to be a two. Matt Chairman went so quickly with the paddle boards that I don't think the scoreboard saw it either, so they're trying to get it back to where we where we were. So the four-point move for sure for Chumakova is wiped out. That's why the challenge brick was given back to Moldova. Two athletes, very calm, looking over toward the scores table. They have reached it. It's tied at four. Criteria is with Chumakova. So now, for the first time, Nachita trailing, 40 seconds to go, and a warning for the finger interlocking. Back to their feet, 37 seconds to go. Criteria the difference right now. Moldova in the blue. The defending champion needs to take that. Or at least a point, any way she can get it. 
Chumakova smothering front headlock position. This is a time meter clock dwindling down, and now they're going to stop it. Tied at four. Chumakova trying to pull off the upset. 17 seconds to go. Off the two on one, Nachita comes in on her double. Comes up short. Backpedaling is Chumakova. Down to seven. One last shot there by Nachita. Chumakova defending well. Clock to one. We're down to zero. And Russia picks up the win. Oh, what a match. Veronika Chumakova with a big win, knocking off the defending champion from Moldova. It came down to criteria, and it came down to the one exchange that went to